Greetings all, it is I, Sam Farron, and welcome to the finale of Let's Translate Naito no Kiseki. Last time we made it through the final dungeon, and all that's left is to beat the final boss now. But, I went back and checked my side quests, and this charming young gentleman, I guess he's not that young, but he had a side quest for us, and that was to go investigate those uh, stone, uh, like, writing thingamajigs that we found in the old city, or in the... Uh, the city where we fought the administrators, and it ha it had something kind of interesting written there. It was a record from someone who managed to escape, like a Mythos tribe member that managed to escape onto Terra, like before it uh, rose into the air. And but it didn't seem to be Kreha or Signa, and by that time Zex had already died, so we don't know who wrote it. Anyway, they wrote about the truth of the disaster. Uh, like how the world was destroyed once before and it was because like well we already figured it out but the humans misused the mythos tribes technology and destroyed nature and started wars kind of like we're doing right now uh, well if we're to trust what we heard from the ferry the cat the ship captain guy but he also it was also written that the star fragments were there to like kind of teach humans uh, like to show them uh, what, like, actually, what they lost, and, like, to serve as a kind of uh, deterrent so that they don't make those mistakes again, and that's why they are in terror. But it ended up being that no humans, like, ended up living in the, in the city, so I guess they just kind of wasted away there until they fell down to Remnant Island. At least I'm guessing that's what happened. But yeah, let me just really quickly check. Right, everything is done. Now let's go back to where the, the place where the planet is. And uh, fight the final boss. Wait, what is this? This doesn't look like a final boss arena. Uh, the temple of the core of the planet. Don't tell me there's still another dungeon. And I'm... I, I called this video the finale, and I was wrong, just to tell me that's what happened. Is this some kind of temple? Uh, it's the place that oversees the most important thing in Terra, the star of the Constellation Globe. I think Zex and the others are probably here. Alright, let's head forward then. But there's something behind us. That's... Is that it? Star globe? Or, like, the constellation globe? Is that the constellation globe? Yeah, it's still not, uh, like, active at the moment by the looks of it, though. It's not only the core of Terra, but it also, uh, has an important, a very important role in the recreation. What do you mean? I'll tell you. This voice. Signa! The constellation globe will eventually fall to the center of the destroyed world and become its new core. And when that happens, the world will regain its true form and a new history will begin to be carved. So that's how it works? They just switch the cores? Signa, where are you? <laughs> just above you. Come meet me. Naita. Let's go, Noi. Oh. <laughs> he was literally right there. I thought we'd have to take... I thought he was, like, using telepathy or something to talk to us. Maybe he was just yelling down the stairs. <laughs> Alright, how's it going, Signa? I've been waiting for you, to Herschel. Signa. Lord Serum. Where's Zex and Kreia? Uh, they are... Making preparations in a different place. The place we are in now only exists to, uh, like, monitor or, like, oversee the star, the constellation globe from a distance. In order to begin the recreation, myself and Kreia will both have to execute the order for it. Kreia will never order something like that. She said that she'd stop the recreation herself. Oh, that's right, you... Uh, managed to convince her, didn't you? 
oh god, because of that now, her personality is being recreated. They're getting rid of her old heart and memories, and making her into a, nothing but a doll to create, to complete her mission. Kray is managing to resist, but I think it's only a matter of time. How could he? Are you really okay? Kray's your sister, isn't she? Don't make me say this more times than I have to. She's nothing but a small sacrifice in the face of our grand mission. If having a heart is a detriment to the recreation, then it is nothing but a burden. Lord Sound, why? You chose to discard your mission once before, but so why? Yes, I'm actually deeply regretting that. It is true that over many years, humans have managed to regain their culture, but the life of the planet is continuing to fade. And to make things worse, the wars and destruction of nature that were the trigger for it before are being repeated now. It would have been best to carry out the recreation back then. So you're saying that that's why it's right to destroy the Earth? You're wrong. Surely you understand. You live with me in Remnant Island, remember? Oh, honestly, we aren't getting anywhere. My will is firm. You won't shake me with mere words. In that case... Signa, I challenge you to a one-on-one -on -one duel. Uh, are you saying you'll fight without Noi's help? Your resolve is being backed by your pure strength. In that case, the only way to stop you is to show you even more strength. Or like a strength that beats yours. I'm right, aren't I, Signa? <laughs> is there no limit to your hubris? Do you really think you can win against me? I can. I come this far to protect what's important to me. I could never lose to someone like you who's chosen to discard everything. And then, I'll get Kreia back. Okay, I'll leave this fight to you, Naita. This is probably something that only you can do as his best friend. Very well. In that case, I'll guide you to the perfect place for our fight. The hell is this place? This is... I created a subspace here. A place detached from the world, where not even Noi or Zext would be able to interfere with us. So now we can fight with everything we've got. I'll break you, here and now. Oh shit. Let's go, Signa! Come, Nayuta! Oh my god, this is cool. Dude, this is so cool. I can't use... I can't even use my sword skills, what the hell? Yeah, it won't let me dash attack. This is just... I can't even use my invincibility attack. That's what I'm trying to do. Oh god. 
Oh god! Oh my god, he can guard too! Of course, we have the same master, don't we? Oh, this is such a fucking cool fight. I was hoping for this. I was really hoping we'd get to fight him without Noi. Oh no. Damn it. Fuck, fuck. Oh my god. Oh, I got him down. If you hit him enough times in a row, I think he gets, uh, he falls on his feet. Damn it. Damn it, that attack's hard to avoid because you can't jump over him. Can I use Bento as I can? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, he's using my attacks too. Oh, let's go. Dude. Yeah, guarding's the way to beat this guy for sure. You do get a decent amount of invincibility, what the hell? He just used noise thing. It's insane that we're fighting in 2D. Oh shit. Oh my god. Dude. This fight is hard. Bruh! Bro, what the fuck did he just do to me? He just used like a fighting game soup or something. Alright, I think I figured out how to beat this guy pretty well. You don't get it by that starters. You pretty much lure him into a corner and then, oh shit, that was a super. I got him way lower than this last time though. He didn't have, he didn't have a use though. Yeah, if he hits you, jump away immediately so he doesn't combo you. That attack's pretty easy to guard. Damn it. You got me jumping. You got me jumping again. Oh my god, that actually tried to suck me in. Stop doing that. Oh my god, that's not even hard to dodge. Fuck, are you kidding me? I even got a trophy. Uh, I guess for guarding like a million times or some shit. Bro, what the fuck? He hit me, but I got out of it. I fucking got it, but you kidding me? He gets more defense when he gets to this point of the fight, too. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh my god, finally, Jesus Christ. Every time I had him on the ropes, he'd always use that super thing at the worst possible time, and that thing just kills me in one hit. If it hits me, even if I'm at full health. I wanted to beat him without using Bento's too. Ah, uh, Naita! The thing that helped me the most was that my sword had way more range than his. The problem is I stun and he doesn't, so if I get hit by one, then it's one hit from him, it's annoying. But I can, like, keep on outranging him, so that was pretty good. <sighs> I did it! <sighs> to think you'd really actually beat me. <laughs> this is the first time I've won whenever we've had, like, a falling out. A falling out, huh? <laughs> I guess so. I guess maybe that's all it was to you. I honestly believe that the recreation was necessary. After joining the Defense Force in Senseries, I was exposed to a lot of the dirtier parts of the world of humans. It wasn't just because I got my memories of Serum back. Lord Serum, I was prepared for losing Remnant Island due to the recreation as well. But I'll bear that sin with me as I live and continue to suffer in order to atone for it. No, that's too sad. I get it. But there are some things you can't gain without sacrifice. No, that's just running away. Now that I've seen the ancient memories and I know that what happens in the past, I won't let humans make the same mistake. There's got to be a way, a way to save everyone. And I'm definitely going to find that. Naita. So that's your resolve. Thanks. Huh? Ever since I returned to being Serum, I've betted on one thing. Or like I decided to place my hope in one thing that someone would come along with a will uh, and oppose the recreation and that that person would have the power to see that through and appear before me. I was hoping that the guy that's like a brother to me, Naita, that you would make it here. Uh, and if uh, Naita couldn't do that much, I decided that that was, that humans weren't worth saving and that I would continue to fulfill my mission as Sarah. But, but you managed to beat me, and you showed me your power and strength of will. Thanks to that, I can now say for certainty that the recreation is wrong. Thanks, Naita. Honestly, you're strangely stubborn sometimes, you know that? Although I suppose that part of you that never gives up on something once they believe it's right is also part of your, like, Good points. But, uh, don't make me worry so much, okay? <laughs> Sorry. I'm not very good at things like that. I've decided. I'll go with you to the Constellation Globe. Not as Serum El Ordin, a member of the Mitos, Mitos tribe. As a human who lived on Earth, as Signa Al Hazen. Signa, you came back to us. Yep, and I gotta get back my cute sis too while I'm at it. Of course, only if you'll let me though. Of course we will. As long as I'm with you, Signa, I feel like we can get Kreia back. Sorry, Naita. Or, thanks, Naita. And, yeah, he said thanks again. Lady Kreia decided to, uh, help us out too. If we have the two Shining Wings of Mythos on our side, then we'll be able to stop the recreation. Yeah, and after that we can think of a different way to save the world, aside from the recreation. But I think we'll probably have to take down Zext, since he's become like this after all. Oh yeah, that was, that was kind of bothering me too. Uh, 
Do you know why uh, Zex, who was supposed to have died, came back? Yeah, that's... What are you doing? Zext! You came, did ya? I'm asking you what you're doing. Serum, are you planning to betray me? <laughs> you can call this my rebellion phase. Just came a, bit, a little late. Wait, where's Kreia right now? Don't tell me you've already... Kreia? Oh, you mean that useless daughter of mine. <laughs> Who knows? Where did she go? Wait a sec, that aura surrounding you. Isn't that the uh, Shining Wings of Mythos? Huh? No. What did you do with Lady Kreia? She is dead. I plan to give her a new personality, but she resisted too much, you see. In order to take back the shining wing that I needed for the recreation, I took all of her power. She will no longer wake up. No. You're lying. Zax, you bastard! Oh no. Signa! It is unlike you to lose your cool at something like this. It looks like you were contaminated by the humans after all. Oh no. Uh, Signa's shining wing. <laughs> now the power that I shared with them has been returned to me. Worry not, my children, your sacrifice will not be in vain. Now, Constellation Gloom, awaken. Constellation cube or globe started. It's activated. <laughs> How beautiful. Now then, children or child of man, gaze upon your transient world's end there. Wait! Ah. Uh, at this rate, the uh, recreation's gonna start. Signa, are you okay? Don't worry about me. Go after that guy. I'll open the wor road. That's another uh, teleportation device. The constellation globe is beyond the place that that leads to. Now, hurry and go. Signa. The only ones left who can stop this are you, too. I'll leave the rest to you, partner. Signa? Signa, stop joking around. Open your eyes, Signa! Wait, this could be... Wait, oh no. Signa turned to stone? This is a state of suspended death for the Mythos tribe. It's probably because he got his shining wing and his, all his star power stolen. If he's in a state of suspended death, does that mean we can still save him? If we don't hurry, he'll weather and fade into star power. Before that happens, we need to defeat Zex and get his power back. I think if we do that, we'll also be able to save Lord Lady Kreia. Let's hurry, Noi. 
We'll stop Zex from completing the recreation and save Signa and Kreia. Yeah. Wait for me, Signa. Uh, we'll, we'll take care of the rest. Alright then. Wow, so we're back to the world map. Wait, what? There's another level? Oh my god, I thought this was going to be the finale. What the hell? Well, you know, I hate to have to do this, but I've been recording for a while, so I think I'm going to end off the video, and next time we're going to uh, go do the real final dungeon. So I'll see you guys then.